Hey guys, this is Clay here at Lewis RV Center. Today I'm going to show you the Salem 32 RLDS. It's a rear living DS stands for double slides, and this unit has two slides on it. Force River on the Salem's. Everything's electric. The tongue jack's electric. All the stabilizers are electric. So it makes it really easy for you to set it up. It won't be any cranking involved or any hard work. Uh, it does have a rock guard here on the front that will protect it from rocks going down the road. And it also has a smooth fiberglass front cap on it. A lot of trailers in this price point uh, will have a metal uh, front cap. This is a lot more durable and it even looks nicer. Uh, and it even uh, driving down the road, it will go smoother and help with uh, airflow and aerodynamics on it as well. Uh, this unit is prepped for solar panels. So if you wanted to get a solar panel, it's all already prepped and wired here. Uh, you plug it in, sit the solar panel in the sun and it will charge the battery. Uh, this unit has a electric awning, uh, comes out 13 and a half feet with the LED light that goes all the way across. Uh, you also have outside speakers here, so you can play FM or AM radio outside or Bluetooth to your phone and play your favorite songs. Uh, Forest River on the, on the Salem's just changed a few things or upgraded a few things. Now it has a black tank plus. Uh, the water heater's gas or electric, not just electric or not just gas, it will do both now. Uh, and also it has the new heated and enclosed underbelly, so now it has it's fully enclosed underneath and heated. So you can take this out um, in cold weather and you won't have to worry as much of it freezing up or giving you any kind of problems. Also the underbelly is a new accessibility. Um, it comes out, comes apart in panels. Uh, it makes it a lot easier if you ever have to service anything underneath it. Um, it will cut your service bill in half maybe uh, because it's a lot easier on the service department or if you're doing it yourself because it will come out in panels that don't have to mess with taking the whole underbelly off. So uh, you also have an outlet out here. Uh, this unit is prepped for a backup camera so it's already has the brackets already wired for if you wanted to add a backup camera. Uh, Salem's have this solid step on it. It's really easy on your knees and it doesn't shake the trailer getting in and out. Uh, so kids can literally be running in and out and it's not going to be shaking the trailer or somebody's in taking a nap or uh, you know eating breakfast whatever it is at the table uh, and then this unit uh, weighs 8300 pounds and it has a just a lot of room inside here you can see how gorgeous the colors are it's real modern light colors uh, these are recliners they go all the way back and they're super comfortable uh, seriously, the first time I sat in them, I wanted to go buy one. Uh, you have the couch back here. Uh, this will open up and Forest River gives you these uh, three plastic totes to make it easier for you to get what's inside, store it in there and bring them out here. Uh, this will jackknife like a futon couch into a bed. Uh, and then your entertainment center, center area is here and you can put a 55 inch TV here so you can put a big flat screen TV. You have a Furion sound system, sound bar. It sounds really good for music or when you're watching your favorite TV shows. And this unit does have a electric fireplace. It will spit out real heat using electricity. So 50 degree day, you don't have to waste your propane. Just turn the fireplace on and it will heat up this whole area here. Um, also, um, you have the furnace ducted in the floor. Uh, this unit is a 50 amp unit and it has we don't get the 13.5 thousand smaller air conditioner. We order ours here at Lewis RV Center with the big 15,000 BTU AC. And then you have another air conditioner in the bedroom that's a 13.5 thousand that's not ducted. This one here is ducted. Uh, so when this air, air conditioner is on, it's gonna be blown out of every duct on the roof. Uh, this unit has the full kitchen. It has a 10.7 cubic foot electric refrigerator. Very large, almost like what you'd have in your house there. You have the residential size oven. Uh, you have a recessed uh, three burner stove uh, with a glass stove top that you can fold up. It becomes your backsplash and it makes it really easy to clean. And then of course you have a residential 900 watt microwave. Uh, you have a 50-50 sink, uh, which I think I like the 50-50s better because it makes it easier to wash your dishes. And you have a very residential faucet that comes out like that. Uh, no tea molding on the countertops. A lot of brands will have the tea molding that will over time, it starts peeling. Uh, this is all recessed. Uh, it's not going to uh, peel or give you problems down the road. Uh, and then we can go into the bathroom. 
It has a very oversized, large shower. And if you are a taller person, they put the sunroof on top of the, or on top of the ceiling. Uh, that way, if you are taller, you don't have to bend down when you're taking a shower. You also have uh, storage in the bathroom and you have plenty of room around the toilet. Uh, some, some models will have the toilet and you don't have any room when you're sitting down on it. It makes it very uncomfortable. Uh, this floor plenty of a lot of foot room in here. And what most people love about this unit is the bedroom. It has a huge bedroom with a, a normal 60 by 80 queen size bed. You have USB ports on each side, uh, outlets on each side for you, making it easy. You have a lot of cap, uh, closet space, a giant closet that goes all the way across here. And what's crazy about this travel trailer unit is you have washer and dryer hookups. So you can put apartment stackable washer and dryer in there and be able to wash all your clothes. And you have an extra closet on this side as well. So for a travel trailer, this is going to have more closet space than just about any of them. Also, the bed lifts up. And you have a lot of storage underneath the mattress and then you get four or three plastic totes in the living room here you have four cloth totes underneath the bed you have on all the windows a forest river on the salem's they put these blackout shades which these are the same shades that you're finding 50 60 70 thousand dollar big fifth wheel units you can sleep during the daytime if you put these things down it's going to be like pitch dark in here so people that have night jobs where they have to sleep during the daytime they love these type of shades um, also last thing i'll point out is forest river just upgraded their uh, roof panels here or ceiling panels uh, makes it easier to clean uh, and they're just more durable and they look gorgeous on the unit but guys this was the 32 rlds salem by forest river come out and see it at lewis rv center our address is 1600 east reno oklahoma city we're half a mile east of the bass pro downtown give us a call 405-232-1800 hope you guys liked it